Texas lawmakers in different political parties agree that the U.S. should help dreamers. They are supporting legislation that would give the youngsters a path to citizenship after they were brought here illegally by their parents. Political reporter Jack Fink tonight live in Dallas is what this all means looking ahead. Jack? Well, Doug, Texas Senator John Cornyn told me today he thinks legislation is going to be passed in either January or February. Now, that is before the March deadline that President Trump set when Obama-era protections for DREAMers will start to expire for good. This is my home, and going back to Mexico would be heartbreaking for me and my family. Juan Carlos Cerda is one of nearly 800,000 people in the U.S. brought here by their parents illegally when they were children. At a forum in Dallas today, he urged Congress to pass legislation that would give him and others like him a path to citizenship before their legal status expires. I am 11 months away from another dark period in my life. I will be unable to participate in the society. Today, Republican Congressman Joe Barton of Ennis and Democratic Congresswoman Eddie Bernice Johnson of Dallas said they support legislation to help dreamers. We need laws to protect these young people. We have hired their parents so they wouldn't be here. They don't have a home country to go home to. Uh, they're already home here in America. So that's the first reason. And then the second reason is it's just the right thing to do. It's the fair thing to do. At a separate news conference today, Texas Senator John Cornyn said it's important to demonstrate compassion toward the youngsters. But at the same time... I think it's a great opportunity for us to get a, uh, some legislation passed on border security and enforcing the current law. They don't have a pathway to citizenship, and I think uh, that's part of the negotiations. They must find it in their hearts to support young people who grew up alongside their son and daughters and give us the same rights. Now there are two different bills. The DREAM Act supported by Democrats and a few Republicans which would give DREAMers a path to citizenship. And then there's an alternate bill supported by Republicans that could ultimately lead to permanent residency status. Live in Dallas tonight, Jack Fink, CBS 11 News. All right.